Not surprising. Guards at the ready. Revelio. Incendio. Protego. Revelio. Repero. Lumos. This must be the way forward, but to where?
Incendio! Wanted to see me, Headmistress Fitzgerald, Professor Rackham. Miss Isadora Morganach, welcome. Professor Rookwood, Professor Bacar. We understand that you are adjusting well to life at Hogwarts. I am. I am glad, especially in light of your unusual situation, starting as a fifth year. As it happens, I was also admitted to Hogwarts as a fifth year. I've never heard of another like us. Miss Morganoff, when we spoke yesterday after class, you asked about the beautiful swirls you saw years ago when we visited your hamlet. I recognized you all immediately. I cannot thank you enough for what you did. We were glad to help. And yes, I did see swirls of magic everywhere that day. My father insists it was my imagination running wild, but it was certainly real to me. It was not your imagination. Percival, Professor Rackham can see them too, but we have never known of another who could. I don't understand. What are they? The whispers or traces that appear when a particular form of ancient magic is wielded. Ancient magic? Few are capable of wielding it. Hogwarts itself is a stronghold of ancient magic. So if I can see traces of ancient magic, does that mean I can wield it too? With the proper training. But 
Let us not get ahead of ourselves, Miss Morganak. Before I can train you to wield such magic, you must first master all that Hogwarts has to offer. A magic this powerful can do great harm in the wrong hands. It must be wielded by a select few. As such, we ask that you not speak to anyone about what we have discussed here today. Sebastian. Sneaking in the restricted section again! I had thought we were through with this mischief. Clearly detentions are insufficient. I'm afraid I must take this to the headmaster. But that being said, Peeves informs me that you didn't come alone tonight. If someone has coerced you, I would have you tell me. You're a bright boy. Don't waste this. There was nobody else. I came alone. Oh, Sebastian. What will your uncle say? <laughs> Revelio. Accio. Lumos. Hello. I, I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello. I'm Lenore. Everyone thinks I... If I know... If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been wrecked. Do come and find... That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. This looks like the location from the painting. What could be so special about it? Revelio. Levioso. Accio. Lumos. Spend time with any of the mer people from the lake. Levioso. Serves them right for talking about the lake.
Prepare her. Revelio. 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 Repera. Surely those are curdle. I'm far too afraid of heights to fly on a broom. Why not? It's nothing to be of. I don't see you wasting bell towers. Incendio. Levioso. Accio. Stirred clockwise. I've always said that travel broadens oh, the mind. So I'd be curious about a beautification potion. But not for me, Moonlight. Two pinches of angel Incendio. <laughs> Repair. Akio. Levioso. <laughs> Incendio. After Sharp's last class, I... It's no wonder Raven's not so clever that it is it. Having to solve things every time you want to go... I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Off on another adventure. Oh. Of course it is. She's right. Thank you.
You cannot be serious. Goblins working with Rookwood makes no sense. It is rather unorthodox, to say the least. Unorthodox? It's inconceivable. It's... Ah, Fig. You have a visitor. I'll see what I can find out. Hmm. Sir, I was able to search the restricted section while you were with Professor Black. It was a book we were after. What? That's... Wait. You accessed the restricted section? But how? Thinking on it, perhaps it's been... Fair enough. In fact, the book... I want to hear everything. First, let's have a look. Oh. Oh, dear. Some of these pages seem to be missing. It appears someone has got to the book before us. Still, I will need time to study what remains. Perhaps we can still salvage something useful, though it may take some time. I wonder why it was here, below Hogwarts. I think I know, sir. I saw two more memories where I found the book. Another pensive, Godric's heart. The man we saw before, Percival Rackham, was a professor here. The first memory showed him and three other professors using ancient magic to restore a hamlet from a drought. Miriam was right. They were talking to a student who started as a fifth year, like I did. She could see traces of magic too. Why those memories? Now I'll have to take it with me to London. The headmaster has insisted that I speak directly to the minister about George's death. What will you tell them? I don't know how much I dare say. My instinct is to... I understand. I'll see what I can learn about the missing pages while you're gone. Good. Don't neglect your studies. Your wand work is improving by the day. But Plenty to keep me occupied while you're gone. Oh, and don't neglect your friends. You may be surprised by how much you can learn from them as well. your dueling metal and see if we've a new school champion. Meet me at the usual place for the final round of crossed ones. Also, the training dummy is still available. Meet me in Lower Hogsfield as soon as possible. I would like to talk to you about Rookwood and Harlow, and it might be best to do so outside of the castle. Professor Fig and Weasley have asked that I teach you an additional defensive spell. Please complete the assignments I have given you, and then proceed to see me in my classroom.
How nice to see you, my young friend. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Last time I saw you. Revelio. Just onion again. Good morning, Professor Garlic. How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora dear. Oh, here, you'll need these for today's class. Uh, um, uh, a little treat for your auntie. Welcome the newest rose in our garden. We do look forward to growing together. How thrilling it is to have everyone back together again. This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is knowledge. The prudent herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacular than the bouncing bulb. Then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the mandrake root. Accio. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? <laughs> First, let's protect our ears. <laughs> Grip their mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. like a warm, dirty blanket, putting the mandrake right at ease. Repair it. I'm very sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. All right then, off you go. Splendid work, everyone. Now for our next task, we'll be planting dittany at our potting tables. You can all get... Hmm, I wonder if hippogriffs like mock grass. Yes, Professor. Firstly, well done. Actually, I enjoy... How kind of you. Now, as I mentioned... I already have some, Professor. You've visited them. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the class. Plant the seeds there now. Let's see how to balance my star thistle arrangement. Niffler's fancy. Italy's restorative properties make it a vital ingredient in the Wiganweld potion, as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class. Well 
done. Now, you'll find that some plants are better suited to uses outside. The cabbages do get... Yes, Professor. Come back and see me when you're... Hello. Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. I'll be showing you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us. The best time to plant a seed is last season. The second best time is now. Rebellion. Did you know? I do wonder about Professor Fig. He's hardly ever in his classroom. Most strange. Nice work in defense against the dark arts, by the way. Excuse me? Your duel with Sebastian. And he's good. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. But you outright slaughtered him. It was brilliant. Oh. Well, thank you. I nearly put Sebastian in his place. Here we are. Hope. Mind your thing. Now, see that dummy? Just toss the cabbages at it, and they'll do the rest. Look at that! They'll chomp on anything they can get their uh, mouths on. <laughs> Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Vicious little bastards, aren't they? I'm not saying you can't go it alone. I suppose they could. It's chaos out there. Dogweed and death. You get the idea. Take your time. I'll see you back in class. Revelio. And with that helpful reminder as to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves, I shall end our lesson here. I tended to the Chinese chomping cap. Remarkable and good. Magical plants have so... I'm glad. are really relishing their new pots. Only cost me my damned hearing.
future champion coming through. Hello, Lucan. Is the final round of cross ones ready? Big match today. It all come. Ready for a shot? I certainly am. Brilliant. Yes, Sabat. Then let. We can make this a real victory. That's the spirit. Incendio. There goes my wife. Akio. Levioso. Levioso. Incendio. Levioso. Incendio. Protego. Come on! Incendio! I'm just pleased to have done as well as I did. And we're pleased to have such a gracious champion. Now, to the victor goes the prize! And so it is my great honour to present you with this simple yet elegant token of supreme dueling accomplishment. Thank you. It's been an honour. You earned it. You are a duelist to be reckoned with. Now that we've definitively crowned the tournament winner, I suppose I should get back to my schoolwork. Wonder how my herbology plants are doing. I haven't tended them in ages. Lost to a new student? Hmm, I didn't see that coming. Hello, Lucan. I'd like to practice with the training dummy. Excellent idea. This time will be a bit more of a challenge. Ready? That'd be brilliant. Wonderful. I'll set things up. If you need to stop practicing. Akio. Incendio, let me also. Good one. Accio, Incendio. Excellent fall. Incendium. Accio. Incendio. Levioso. Accio. 
here. I'd hate to face you in a duel. Thanks, Lucan. You've been a great help. Oh, stop. Don't make me blush. Seriously, well done. Training dummies will think twice before challenging you again. Even though you won the tournament already, I'm glad to see you haven't stopped training. Stay sharp, my friend. him look completely incompetent, which he is. I saw an awe badge on Professor Sharp's desk. Revelio. I bet he knows more than he's letting on about the Goblin Rebellion. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld Potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld Potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Points for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a Wigan Weld potion of your own. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plot. Others, however, come and see me. Professor Sharp, 
Professor Sharp said that Wiganweld potion can... Don't fret if you run out of ingredients. My parents considered keeping me home from school this year. Did I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office. He did say that. He... Brilliant! I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. Bit of a... Pleasure to meet you. She's my aunt. Listen, I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. Hi. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a sing... I'll get you the foie perfect. I assure you, wait until you see... A well-prepared witch... Revelio. Your potion should not be that colorless, McDowell. Here's the fwapper feather you wanted. Brilliant! Thank you! This is going to take a moment to brew. You should get back to brewing your adieu. Should you chop the didney or crush it? The wrong answer could result in the unfortunate loss of your eyebrows. And now we add the mallow sweet, and that's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Ah! Get it! Again! Oh! Mel! Dragon Duck! What happened? <laughs> well done, Gareth. What now, Mr. Weasley? Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor, again. Mr. Weasley did not do this on his own. His accomplice will answer to me as well. I brewed an Adurus potion as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. I'm sorry, Professor. I was merely trying to help a friend. Taking responsibility for one's actions does go a long way with me. I shall assume that you've learnt a lesson. As for the work you did today at your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I confess I was sceptical given the... I'm glad I was able to meet you. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having... Pay particular... Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot... That'll be all. I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. My Wiganwell potion is utter rubbish. Wish I could just... That was an interesting class. Thanks to you. Wasn't precisely what I had in mind, but it was still brilliant. I, pr I hope Sharp wasn't... Professor Sharp. Cheers to that. Sharp may seem best be off. Hello there. Ugh, my robes are going to reek from Gareth's inspiration. This looks like the location from the painting. What could be so special about it? I'm just say. I really have made a mess of things. Is everything all right? Oh, you see, my arms get so tough, but I must have confused the... That sounds brilliant. Thank you. I collect the... our meat. Perhaps you? I suppose I could... Oh, I'd very... if you could collect...
My brother just died. Revelio. Professor Hackett is an enigma. Federation of Music. Off on another adventure. Revelio. I should investigate. It is good to see you, my friend. Hello, Natty. How are you? I hope you've recovered from our rather eventful trip to Hogsmeade. I am well, but I have been worried about you, my friend. With Ranrock and Rookwood... I'm all right at the moment. We did not speak about it at the time. They want something that prof... When were you... Just before we came to Hogwarts, a portkey brought... What on earth? There's one more thing. Professor Figs. Is that the magic you used? I think so. I know that's a lot to... It is. For now, it is... I realized something that you displayed... Both of you have it. What sort of stand? 
Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the re- I am not going to- Good. All the more reason. Rumor has it taking him down. That may be true. I spoke with her. I overheard some of Rookwood. I was thinking- All right. I am going to watch and live. In the meantime- Thank you, Natty. Be on your guard. Handy Rebellion. resource indeed, your field guide. I, mean, I beg your pardon. How dare you threaten me? What's going on here? Oh, Archie, oh. I don't have time to argue. I've told you repeatedly not to stray far from I home. never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. Pardon me, is everything all right? Hardly. I've just lost my business and almost my life. I never thought they attacked you. Oh, Ranrock, when I said as... I'm sorry, this... That is very... I did enjoy... Slim, though. It was nice meeting you. I wish it had been under better circumstances. Hello, sir. Hello. What do you have for sale? I sell my ingredient. Can you tell me? Oh, my price is up. Any whispers going about? Them? There's a thief. She's stealing it. Catherine's hiding. What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? I'll have no trouble selling this. Thank you. Ah, yes, a wonderful choice. I hope to see you again sometime. After what Ranrock did to that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised. They must have come this way. Think! I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to... Victor Rookwood, don't give a dog she's nip back your time. Oi, speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student, you can't be so... <laughs> Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Stupefy! You're gonna regret coming here. <laughs> I shall kill you for this when I get down from here. <laughs> Really enjoying the view. I'd like to be put down now. I'll watch the light go out of your eyes. Get on! I'm not going anywhere with you. You'll take this! Oh, sorry. 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 Sorry.
Just happened. I've never been accosted in such a manner. Since the very Hogwarts. Are you all right? I am, thanks. Care to tell me why? Ashwinders. It's a long story. Hmm. Best get moving on my. You mentioned someone. Yes, my. Typical, hard-working Hufflepuff, brilliant potioner, has her own shop in Nocturne Alley. She's a travelling vendor. Here's what's going on in the Highlands before I do. You're a researcher? Nor a tre... I thought that Merlin and the town... Mere chatters on... Merlin and the Fixtures. These vi... I believe. I can see why you're... Well, then. No one is, I suspect. Mallow sweet. Versatile. I had just, you see me. The mallow sweet is precise. I brought a trunk chock full of mallow sweet with me. It's just over there by my tent. This trunk? Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. I have the mallow sweet. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone swell on the ground. Each trial has these features. Place the mallow sweet on the swell, and we'll see what happens. My word! Did you see that? The vines disappeared! What should I do now? Hmm, this is uncharted territory. Incendio! I curious about these pyres. Levioso! Reparo! Accio! These pillars are pyres, and pyres are meant to be lit. Incendio. The flames make the pyre sink. I take it we can call that a success? We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my... Are all of the trials like... Hmm? Oh, not precise. You should feel free to solve them. My guess is that which you can find in Hogsmeade, should you need more. I really mu And do be careful out here. Now I've got what I needed, I shall return to the safety of my notes and books. Can I beseech you for some assistance? Hello, can I help? Oh, thank good. I was hoping someone would come. You see... Diving into the... Splendid! What do you need help? Years ago, they never... I'm so sorry. We can't be sure. Father was a treasured... Hmm, it sounds... I and... I've cross -re My best get. Greetings, young Slytherin. Scrope knows about the old book you found for Professor Fink. Scrope can help you. And you can help Scrope. Get to the courtyard past the pendulum. 
If you don't know it, you'll see it easy enough. And don't tell anyone what you're up to. Especially Professor Ben. This must be where the Pinch Smedley family astrolabe is. I should let Grace know that I found her family astrolabe. Too terribly difficult. Uh. Hello, Grace. I oh, how incredible! I did. I hope it makes your father happy. It. W Thank you so. You do well to keep an eye out for more. Thank you again, and I do hope you keep diving. You certainly have a knack for finding treasure. Hmm. Seems a pleasant enough little place. After what Ranrock did to that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Arn. Revelio. Shame you're so foul. Revelio. Incendio. Protego. 
past the ruins. I'm on the right track. An encampment. This must be it. Revelio. Incendio. Revelio. Looks as if there's more than one. Arn will regret not joining us. If he doesn't come round now, he'll be made even more of an example. <laughs> Incendio. No! I will give you all the... Oh! Incendio. I won't be. Accio. Teach you nothing! No. Not quite. Incendio. I won't bet. You can't stop us. That was meant for me. I've been fighting Incendio. since before you were born. A mist! Taste goblin silk. Easily diverted. Your spells glance off of me. Was that your best? Leviosa! Incendio! Revelio. That was quite something. 
Now, to free Arn's carts. What do you have in store for me this time? Revelio. Quite an enchantment. The carts are returning to Arn. Levioso. Revelio. Levioso. Levioso! <laughs> Revelio! Incendio.
Levioso. Repairo. Incendio. Revelio. Cast fiends. Let's play. Revelio. Incendio. Incendio. Revelio. Levioso. Accio. Revelio. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Revelio. Incendio. Repairer. Revelio. Not my fault you're a deadly great spider. Incendio! 
Protego! Revelio. Incendio. Revelio. Levioso Revelio Rebellio. Incendio. On, I have good news. Your carts are on their way back. I don't, I don't know what to say. Any hope I have of getting my belongings back was quickly fading. Ramrock's lot called me a fool for believing in the good and wizard kind. Thank you for proving them wrong. I managed to free your carts fairly easily. Oh, I'm glad you're all right. Oh, I can't wait to have my things back, especially my paints. <gasps> Perhaps my next piece will be a tribute to... What a nice idea. Oh, I can't wait. All the best to you. Once my carts arrive, I'd be happy to show you my work. Hello, Mr. Semi. What can I do for you? What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? See you again sometime.
Not sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. What are you up to now? Take care of everything. Professor, I... Well, pay close attention. Spellcasting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. work. The dummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. Expelliarmus! You seem to have the right end of the stick, but keep practicing. Expelliarmus may save your life one day. Incendio! Levioso! Accio! Expelliarmus! Still at it, I see. I'm going to have to use Akio to get to those books. Akio! Got it. Only four more to go. Revelio! Akio! This must be Cressida's diary. I'd want this back too if I were her. Revelio. Accio. Revelio.
Revelio. the last book. Now to take them back to Cressida. Leviosa! Expelliarmus! Accio! Leviosa! Accio! Hello, Cressida. I collect... Oh, what? I'll happily take this. Here you are. Well, now, to work, perhaps I should start... Thank goodness some people are trustworthy. Certainly wouldn't want anyone but me reading that. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. There's the fountain. I'm getting closer. The Dedalian keys are back. Aren't they brilliant? Is everything... Yes. The what key? The Dedalian... Rumour is... Professor Black... You should try to... Why would I do... Each key will... If you can... Perhaps I'll give it... I hope you do. I hope you follow a few keys at least. If you manage to open a cabinet, I'd love to know what you find, if anything. Revelio. The stairwell looks promising. This looks like the portrait from the map. And where's the treasure? Revelio! A 
here. was a doorway hidden within the portrait. Levioso! Accio! I wonder what came of Arthur's search. We shall. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. What have you learned? Hello, Arthur. Oh, he should... I found what I... Oh, that seems as though we... Well, on to the next Hogwarts mystery. Wonder if a quick rummage round Weasley's office might yield anything interesting. Scrope? Who is Scrope? Revelio. Pumpkins. Ah, I think. 
think I know just the place. Revelio. Down to the water's edge. Hmm, this had better not be a trick. Levioso Accio This looks intriguing Revelio Thank you for coming all this way. The name's Scrope. Scrope serves the headmaster. I've been in the Black family for years. Apologies for the abundance of notes. Scrope wanted to be sure you weren't following. What's this all about? Your note. Scrope can tell you more. Happy to help. Scrope is grateful. Before she died, she was... D I'm sorry to hear... Scrope, believe. Apollonia forbade Scrope from... And Scrope would not... D How did you injure your ear? The blacks have a tradition of... One day, Scrope was able... Tell me more about this trip. Wait. How did you know... Scrope. Scrope. It seems this may help us both. Um, I shall do it. Scrope is relieved. Take this toast to the grotto just down the coast and place it on the pedestal there. Good luck. Scrope will wait right here for you. Best of luck finding your pages. And... Revelio.
Incendio. Why would I need a piece of toast? I suppose that's where it goes. <laughs> <laughs> 